Hello guys and welcome back to my videos. The last video talking about gym essentials went pretty good and people came back at me asking more questions on TikTok, Instagram and YouTube. So here we go. I want to talk about some more factors you all ask me. First of all, everybody that has been following me over social media in the last few years, I'm always working out without any shoes on and I really dislike working out with shoes. So here come three factors why you should work out with shoes too. First of all, I want to mention like it is really, really healthy working out or running around barefoot. It is more naturally than running around in shoes. If you look back in time, when ages ago, we were all running around barefoot. Because, first of all, it is going to strengthen your posture, it is going to improve your posture, because there are so many sensors in our feet that keep our body move naturally. The next thing, you're going to strengthen your food muscles too, which is pretty important because otherwise you might get illnesses on your food and we all know if your food is not standing naturally, this can cause dangerously bad injuries on your whole body. Like I said before, even on your posture. Yes, obviously the last point, it is going to improve your balance. Now, you all know I have pretty good balance, but in order to get more balance, you gotta start easy. The first step is go and train on one leg, barefoot, without any shoes on, and then you can step up. So, keep in mind, wearing no shoes is going to improve your balance. So, the next point I've been asked is, which split are you doing and why did you change your split currently? So, talking of split till now, and this has been now quite a while, I've always been doing push, pull, legs. So you might ask me now, why would you do push, pull, legs? Because first of all, you're going to attract most of your big muscle groups. And it is a pretty easy circle to, stand your, to start your fitness journey. Now, if you wanna improve different muscles and you wanna focus more on, let's say, biceps, or you wanna focus more on back, or you wanna focus more on your glutes, at some point, a push-pull leg split is not going to work for you anymore. Yes, I am not talking about starting off with a different split because I would actually tell everybody go ahead, start off with your push-pull legs because it is a really, really good routine. But after maybe two years or three years, you might want to change up your routine. So I'm gonna go and go ahead to talk about the split I am currently doing and I will tell you why I am going with this split now. So I actually keep doing two leg days, but one leg day is general legs, which means quadriceps, hamstrings, calves. I'm also doing glutes, I'm doing abductors, all those kind of things. On the side, I'm going to focus more on glutes and abductors, whereas hamstrings are going to be a side effect on this day. Why am I doing this? Well, because first of all, I wanna make my glutes grow even more. So I'm attracting them on a different day too. Then I'm actually going ahead with a chest and a biceps day. Now, you might ask why do you attract chest muscle and biceps muscle? Because your fatigue, if you train chest and if you train biceps, these are two muscles you can pretty much train without making the other muscle fatigue. Now this also refers to the day where I train shoulders with triceps. Same thing happening. If I do shoulders with lateral raises, with shoulder press, I'm not making my triceps fatigue if I do shoulders. Then I do have a special day for my back because I want to get stronger. Back has so many exercises that attract the full back that you can't mix it with any other muscle group. So 
So I pretty much went ahead and split it in a simple single day. So I wasn't really able to film yesterday's kickboxing session because I really needed to focus on myself, on my knee, but I just had physiotherapy and I filmed pretty much everything for you. I'm going to go and show you in the next clip, so stay tuned, this is going to be fire because it was a lot of fun. <laughs> To answer the last question of this vlog, what I actually like to do when I'm not just training, kickboxing, calisthenics, working, well, pretty much, and showing some time with friends out doing whatever I like. So I'm pretty active, which means I love to ice skate, I love to do bowling, I love to play billiard. What I absolutely hate is drinking alcohol, parties and all those kind of stuff. So, yes, tonight we will be enjoying some ice skating in Innsbruck. And yes, maybe, maybe we'll actually drink some Christmas chewies. I don't know how to call it in English afterwards on the Christmas market. And yeah, that's pretty much the plan for the day. So let's go. Thank you. 